Man, what's up, y'all? Chosen One Rising back with another video. Namaste, 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 family. You will leave this video with more balance, more love, and more understanding, understanding, and overstanding. So check this out, y'all, about a serious topic. People, they will put people around you that's going to persuade you to think that you need to be scared of this shit. Just because you're not, you don't mean you're weird because you're not scared of this shit. You don't have to be scared of it because you know that when you're in fear, you're more vulnerable to be controlled. And fear weakens the immune system. You know these things, bro. Standing in the crib weakens your immune system. You know these things, bro. So with that being said, you have to really think for yourself. Beats. You can't ask these bots, these third dimensional. If you are sending to the third dimension, you cannot ask these third dimensional bots for any type of advice because they will give you a third dimensional answer. Don't think that when you make these videos that this shit gonna make sense. When you when people tell you certain shit don't mean it's gonna make sense. It's not gonna make sense, bro. You gotta realize these people were put here for a reason. To bring down your vibration. Everybody's not gonna wake up, bro. Everybody's not gonna wake up. So you need to live with that. You need to come to the realization that everybody's not gonna wake up, bro. You need to leave some people alone. Let them have their own spiritual awakening. Let them come to their own senses naturally, bro. Stop trying to force to change people. They're going to make you, put you around people that's going to make you. Just because you catch a little cold or you get a little sick. Like, niggas, don't forget that we still have catch colds out here. Don't forget that we actually be having runny noses out here or sneezing a lot. That don't mean shit. Cause just because you cough, that don't mean shit. Don't just think corona, 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 because you can still have a cold. Cold still exists. Y'all need to stop it, bro. Come to realization. This world will never be the same. Just because you cough down, that means you're going to be judged about, like, you got the coronavirus or something like that, but you'll be keeping it up with your immune system. You can still get sick, but as you get sick, you will be able to strengthen your immune system. You got to think, bro. Don't think that we don't have no sicknesses and nothing like colds and shit. We don't, no, don't think that we don't have any of those things here. We still do. With that being said, we're taking care of ourselves. We out here in nature, barefoot, stepping around in nature, feeling that inner, that inner nature. You see what I'm saying? We feel that in the nature. We will be tied to some people. If you are fifth, fifth dimensionally in the fifth dimension and you have a partner that's in the third dimension, think twice, bro. You really got to... Listen, you can advise them to change and see them, help them see shit for really what you see. But if they don't ascend to the fifth dimension, which they're only going to be holding you down, bro. you only going to be one of them for a certain amount of time, but you're going to start to feel unattractive. You're going to start to feel unattractive. You're going to start to feel like they're holding you back from something. You're going to start to feel like you're forcing it. Nothing in life is supposed to be forced. It's supposed to be like a flow state. It's supposed to flow right through it. These people that's going to be put around you are going to really, 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 really... You got to think, bro. You don't have to take medicine every time you feel like you're sick or something like that, bro. That's what they pressure you to do. Just inhale, exhale. Really, 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 really... Breathe. And really come to your senses like, bro, you know what's going on with your body. You're okay. Don't overreact. People will make you overreact. The news, they're turning up the pressure. These people, they're turning up the pressure. They're putting these people around you that will make you become a fucking bot again. You're not doing anything devilish, bro. I don't accept everybody from every religion, every every belief. I don't, everybody have their own truth, bro. I'm like, just accept truth. For, worry about you. People won't forever judge you. Worry about you. You're not doing anything devilish. You're meditating, taking care of yourself, eating well, worrying about yourself, worrying about your well-being. You're not doing anything devilish. You're having a good experience. So why would people consider that devilish looking from the outside in? The external things, external people leave external people out of your life. Do not ever allow somebody externally to come internally and influence your decisions or influence your emotions, trigger your emotions, bro. Because they're external for a reason, because they do not control you. But you're, you're able to be controlled. You're able to be perception. Your thoughts aren't yours, bro. The thoughts aren't yours, bro. You have to realize that it's raining and stuff like that. But I know I got to get this video out. I had to get this out of my soul. People will forever try to turn you, bro. I promise you. I know it seems like, like they telling the truth so much. But you're going to start to feel like a pain. Like a pain, not a pain. But like a strong sense in your intuition. Like that they're about what they're doing. You're not going to agree with it. Your soul does not resonate with it. Your, your soul does not, your intuition does not make, your, your intuition, higher self, they speak in a calm voice. They're calm. I seen 444. The angel guys are with me. My angel spirits are with me. They know that I'm speaking the truth and speaking from my intuition. They will try to make you seem like you're crazy. They will make you try to seem like that you need to take medicine, bro. 
Just because you're sick, that don't mean you have to think you have corona. You do not have corona. And for the most, most cases, like, come on now. I'm not there with you, but I'm pretty sure that if you're taking care of yourself in nature every day, really enjoying this stuff, you're not sick. You're not sick, bro. You have nothing to worry about. Stop letting people's little words and little sayings control your perceptions because you, everything that you brought yourself here to, did they tell you this or did you, did you find out this stuff from yourself? They don't say people that taught you these religions and taught you these, all these beliefs to be in fear. You gotta think about it. They don't know these things, bro. They're not going. They're not. Their mind isn't ascended. They're gonna try to hurt you. They want to. They, bro. I feel like that. I can feel people's energy, like my family members and my family, like people that's around me. They feel like I, I'm, I may be a threat. I may. I, they may need to get away, away, away from me, bro. But it's not nothing to be sad about. Nothing to be for. Cause you're speaking the truth, bro. It just is what it is. But you gonna have to grow. You have to let people grow to grow. You see what I'm saying? And I seen 555. Five, five. That's a big change coming, bro. A good big change and I'm ready. I'm prepared for everything. My immune system is strong. You may get sick sometimes or something like that, but don't think, don't think just because we got a coronavirus out, you have corona because you get sick, bro. You okay. You ain't you outside getting grounded. You're taking care of yourself. You have nothing to worry about. Remain calm. At these times, you have to remain calm. Or your immune system will be, if you ain't fear, your immune system will be will start to destruct itself. You will start to get fucked up. Stay out of fear. Fake evidence appearing real. Remember that, y'all. Remember that, remember that, remember that, bro. I will not tell y'all nothing wrong. I've been telling y'all good stuff all this, all, like all my, my, my whole YouTube, man. Y'all been seeing me. I've been telling y'all the real. Why would I wait till now to tell y'all something like this? Please understand me. You know you feel it. You feel that I'm telling you the truth, bro. Get that inner bot out of you. Not talk about the chosen ones. Get that inner bot out of you. And chosen ones, step up your pace. Really take time to yourself to really see what resonates with your soul. Question is it your ego or your higher self telling you these answers? You're okay. Don't let people, what people saying to you, control what you are don't, don't don't let other external things control your reality because you are the co-creator of your reality believe that you are the creator of your reality you have to realize that people will come in and out of your life trying to and in this state right here and you're you're in the, in the fifth dimension people will third you can't be around a lot of that's why i'm by myself i can't be around a third i can't be around any third dimensional people because they were bringing down my vibration and they're gonna give you some third dimensional answers and they're gonna tell you what you should be doing and they don't see stuff from really what you should be doing people telling me to telling you to go back to college or do this they don't see stuff from the way you see it they don't tell you they don't see that college is actually a scam you get out have a hundred k debt or something like that, and they only get a twenty k or thirty k or forty k job. That's not it. That's a scam. In return, the best education is you can get from yourself. We are the education. We anything that you need to learn about nature, you out here in nature. Anything you need to learn about yourself, you need you learn about yourself in here. They tell you in school. They tell you about some external things. That's going to not. That's not going to benefit you at all. For the most part. For the most part. They're not going to benefit you at all, especially the fake history they're telling you, the misguided history. Every history and religion sometimes has a truth to it, most of the time. But you got to be able to decode that, chosen ones. I'm believing and trusting y'all. Y'all are strong. We are fearless, bro. Stop. Do not do not let these third-dimensional minds, don't be so quick to let these third-dimensional minds tell you something and change your perception. Because we already made our own perception and we already seen these things for really what they are. Y'all feel me talking to your intuition. Y'all feel me talking to you. You know this truth resonates with you. You all okay, bro. You have nothing to worry about, bro. I promise you. I'm not going to make this video this long. But for people who are letting others control their perception, just think about it. They're talking about from a, sca a scarce or scared standpoint of uh, like a they're scared so they're going to tell you only scared shit you got to wear think about it we wearing the mask what is that going to actually do if it's really an airborne virus out here yo y'all gotta think about it. it's 5g too bro it's fucking 5g radiation out here bro you gotta get you some emf protection i got this right here you gotta get you some emf protection bro take care of yourself get you some crystals bro think before you speak know before you speak understand before you speak don't just jump to conclusions because somebody told you something, bro.